incredible. Um, I, I'm so happy for our kids and their parents and their grandparents and their boyfriends and all of our students that came. Uh, just a great job. I thought we tried to wilt away there in the third set. We got a little passive offensively, but man, oh man, took a little time out. We got our heads back together, put our foot back on the gas, and the kids just played great. They responded beautifully down the stretch. How motivated was this team coming into the week knowing you were going to get a second crack at Blackhawk Christian? That's all we've been talking about all season was let's get another shot. Just give us one more shot at those guys. That's all we've been dealing on all, summer, all season long, all summer long was got to do the work, got to do the work, got to do the work. What was the biggest key to getting off to that first set and uh, taking that commanding two-set lead? I, no real big key. We knew we had to serve them aggressively. We knew that we had to defend the, uh, the three studs on the, out of that group. We knew we had to defend those kids. We did a decent job of doing that, but I felt like we served them into some out-of-system situations where they had to run the pins, and we were able to defend the pin a little bit better. Now, you were against the wall a little bit in that third set. You kind of mentioned you know, got a little bit more passive. But what does that say about this team and their ability to bounce back and close out that set on what? A 6-1 run. That was a, that's exactly what we had to do last weekend. We got ourselves in a little bit of a pinch last weekend in set number four against Faith Christian. And again, we, we slowed down. We just talked, guys, calm down. Where are we trying to go, not where are we? Where are we trying to go? And the kids, again, responded beautifully. Had a couple of swings out of, I, mean, I think it was Pershing, the 15 kid. Had a couple of big swings out of her. Drake did a great job serving the ball in the seam. And we get to play another week. Yeah, I was going to say, one more week with the team. How excited are you to go to Ball State next week? Oh, man, it's a, it's a beautiful situation, and these kids have never experienced it. In fact, a couple of little pregnant mommies that just walked up to me were the last group that got to go there in, in 14. So really excited. I looked at it this morning. I'm standing in a gym. This is going to sound really stupid to you guys, but we have this thing on our wall. It's got all the years we've done things, and we got to the finals in 09 and got killed by Muncie Burris, who won the national title that year. And in 14, we got there. And we got drilled by Providence where my libero didn't touch a ball the whole match. And I thought, 9 and 14 is 23. Heck, maybe this is our year. Well, what, what do you think? So evidently, we got a shot. We, we got a shot. And that's all, that's all you can look for is a chance.